I'm back with similarity question two. So, question two. Another question where I'm going to think about ABC is a triangle, D is parallel to BC, calculate the perimeter of the trapezium DBC. Now I know they are similar, so I'm going to start off by drawing my two triangles and labelling the vertices, the corners. A, D, E, and then I've got A, B, C. I know D to A is four centimetres. And this is where you have to be careful. A to B is six plus my four. So A to B is 10 centimetres. My scale factor then to get from four to 10, what do I multiply by? I multiply by 10 over four. And 10 over four is the same as five over two or multiplying by 2.5. So my scale factor is timesing by 2.5. I'm then going to just do all my new lengths. So I've got, I'll change colour for you. 5.8. 5.8 times by 2.5. So times by 2.5 will give me 14.5. And then along the bottom of D to E, I've got 5 centimetres. 5 centimetres times by 2.5 for my B to C along the bottom is going to give me 12.5. This is where you need to be careful. I want the perimeter of the trapezium DBCE. So that is the perimeter of DBCE. I'm going to fill in all the numbers, all the values, all the lengths that I know from this. I know this is six centimeters from D to B. I know that a to C, A to C is 14.5. A to E is 5.8. So E to C is going to be 14.5, take away 5.8, which gives me 8.7. So I know this length here is 8.7 centimetres. And B to C, as I calculated on my red triangle, is 12.5 centimetres. So the total perimeter of my trapezium is going to be 6 plus 5 plus 8.7 plus 12.5 and I calculated that to be 32.2 centimetres.